Hey everybody, Hidnomjet Guru back with more Frankenstein, the Dismembered Bride. I liked what my voice did there. Uh, best time. Oh, and counting. Are you seeing people... Oh. Okay. Are you seeing people replay this game over and over uh, to try and beat their best time? Because I'm going to go ahead and suspect that's never happened ever. Dead rat... <laughs> I thought we were just going to be looking for pieces of the thing, but no, I was wrong. Uh, so, fun fact here, I've given this game a lot of crap about its uh, terrible, 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 terrible hidden object screen design, which is, you know, half of the world, um, which I don't take any of that back. That's all accurate. It's, it's bad. But you'll notice that they haven't been refilling the hidden object scenes. Not like that terrible... Um, even worse, I was about to start just reusing the term terrible, uh, not like the way, way, way worse uh, first two uh, haunted hotel games where they just refill the screen every time you find yourself collecting the same items over and over again. Ah, okay. Uh, there's the broom. Here, I'm actually cleaning up the screens as I go. I mean, that doesn't feel super satisfying, but I would be lying if I said it didn't feel satisfying at all. Trombo? Yes. Trumpet, whatever. Eggplant, and then the, the screw up there, or is that the last item I need? That's the last item I need. Okay, so there's literally just... Oh, there's the bucket. And I'll say this, a completely logical place. So if you were a dead rat, where would you be? I thought in the mouth of one of these guys, but I was completely wrong. So I need a dead right and... Dead rat. The handle. Um, that door handle doesn't count, and in fact, got me a... Uh, common, a, uh, you're clicking too much comment. Oh, there's the handle. There's a crank handle, huh. Well, as is my want, I'm probably gonna take a hint in a second. I just do not see any sign of this dead rat. Is that it? No, that's not it. I got nothing. I mean, I'll be brutally honest with you. I have absolutely nothing. Alright, let's hit it. Wow, that was very well hidden because it was exactly the same color as dirt. Flogist on light bulb! Yes! Oh, so this time it was Flogiston, is the joke. Logic, I mean, start saying that, I just think about Tom Strong, but uh, that's another conversation. Alright, here we go. Okay. Ew. They've added rats to the screen. Which apparently she was entertained by because uh, Janet is a weirdo. Sorry, Janet, you're a weirdo. Everyone knows it. Uh, okay, four. It's a real. What do you call it? Uh, oh, there we go. S tube of super glue, which I'm gonna need for something at some point. Am I keeping the string so I can stitch her back together? Because if so, ew. Oh, right, the secret passageway. Okay. Wow. These two remain the worst. Anvil. Uh, pile of nails. Scissors. Yes. Trowel. Not so much. Is that a trowel? No, it's not. It was! Yay! I just misclicked. Paintbrush. Now we know there are two different things the paintbrush can look like. It can be a long, thin one, or it can be the one with the broader head. Like, so for painting walls or for painting paintings. Uh, and, of course, we also need the cleaning brush, as we always do. Uh, compass. Oh, it's that kind of compass. Trips me up every single time I play one of these games. Sickle. Uh, is that the paintbrush back there? It is not. Adjustable spanner. You guys just love saying spanner, don't you? All right, well, there's the pliers, there's the spanner, there's the... Ooh, I need a vise? A vise. Like the whole thing, or a vice grip? Oh, set square. Nice. I was ready to click on the saw before it turned on, because there's only so many items left in this uh, screen. All, or a uh, ice pick? Damn it, I didn't need either. Or both. <laughs> in any event. Yeah, still not seeing any stars. Which, I'm a little worried about the fact that I'm running low on uh, hints. Ah, that was a vise. To me, it just looked like an undifferentiated black space. But, uh, yes, I now see that it was a vise. 
Ah, it's that kind of brush. And now the paintbrush. Let's take a quick gander for it before we take the hint. Oh, take the hint. Now I get that. Um, I'm just not seeing anything that could be a paintbrush. What we'll do is we'll take the hint and hope we get a puzzle soon so I can start earning some of those hints back. Which, by the way, I gotta say, I mean, I haven't been very complimentary about this game's structure, but giving me more hints, like a, a glut of hints every as a reward for solving a puzzle is actually kind of a nice mechanic. Oh, wow, that was not even that well hidden. I don't have an excuse. Oh, that was a screwdriver. Really thought that was an awl or an ice pick. Let's see what's down in the torture chamber. Not even going to justify me searching it. I'm just going to start searching it. Ice axe. Halberd. Uh, okay, ice axe. Yay! Still not really a hoe, but whatever. Oh, wow, halberd was the second item. Okay, that's pretty great. Skull, right there. Saw. Not so much. I see a hammer, though. Can I take a hammer? How is a horseshoe this hard to find? Like, they're usually pretty distinctive. Here's the key ring two-edged sword, as opposed to what? I mean, do we have a lot of, like, sabers lying around? I think you could have just said sword, guys. Unless there is also a saber there that, uh... A hammer and a sledgehammer in the same stage. That's... That's something else. Uh, do I need that now? Handcuffs. Now, when you say handcuffs... See, that was just a pickaxe. That is not handcuffs. All right, uh, what do we got here? Something with a spike in it? No, that's, that's nothing. Oh, there's the horseshoe. Oh. All right, how would a ladder wind up being my last item? Like, I thought I was just going to turn around and it would be right there, given, you know, how uh, I'd search for everything else in the game. But, like, a ladder is proving to be the most difficult thing for me to find. Which, again, how do you hide a ladder? It, by its very definition has to be tall enough to help you reach something. Wait, am I seriously going to have to take a hint to get a ladder? That would be madness. Because it's not like they've hidden the ladder in one of these grates, have they? No, of course not. Is it sideways in that one, those bars over there? Like, a ladder, again, by its very definition, has to have rungs. And I don't see any rungs. I was about to say, is it a picture of a ladder? Well, Hoguru, it would still have rungs. Even if it was a picture of a ladder. Alright, we're taking the hint. I don't mind at all. That is definitely not a ladder. And also, two middle fingers aimed at you. <laughs> Biometric sphere motor. Well, thank God it's flashing, because... Yeah. You two are ridiculous. And often in a good way, but not always in a good way. Often, you're just the worst. All right, maybe some more in the lab. No, labs are gonna have to use it, right. Uh, let's try out the attic. Ooh. Just giving me pictures of the things I need to find? You're not even doing silhouettes? So far from cool, guys. Oh, hey, I finally get to pick up that guy. There's the microphone, there's, where's the lamp? Here, lamp, 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 lamp. Here, oh, it's a, that thing. Uh, oh, is that the lion? It was. Uh, is that the, no, that's not a coat. All right, that's as far as I can go to that side. So I need a, a punch doll, candlestick, candle holder, if you will, a lamp, uh, whatever the hell that is, the telephone. Telephone I had already seen, so that wasn't such a chore. Hey, there's the microscope. I almost said microphone. Because I had earlier grabbed the microphone, so that's why it was in my uh, head. Seriously? It's not either of those statues? Is that you? No. You're another statue. Oh, well, there's the lamp anyway. Oh, there's the headless statue. Oh. All right, so uh, we just need to find a candlestick. And before you ask, yes, one of my all-time favorite hidden object games does do the pictures thing. But uh, that was, you know, a much better designed thing. And honestly, uh, there's no better game out there. Well, if it was modernized a little. Than uh, 
Seriously? Am I seriously not finding this thing? Uh, then Campfire Legends, the babysitter. So, you know, it can get away with uh, only having these screens. And honestly, uh, when you're a fully integrated scene, I don't care how you tell me what items I'm looking for. It could be, if you're fully integrated, be silhouettes. I don't care. What I care about is the integration, not the how I'm asked to search for items. And oh my god, I'm really not going to find this thing. Wow. Okay, let's just uh, let's just ask for the hint, please. That is completely invisible. Like, am I crazy or is that completely invisible? I'm gonna click on it now, and you're still not gonna see it. See? Okay. So why did I do all that? Yeah, no, I know that. Oh, it's another uh, slidey puzzle. Good. Well, I was just saying I needed to unlock some... Uh... Damn, this doesn't look like fun. Okay, it's doable, but because it's a uh, four-directional movement. Rather than the terrible uh, two-directional movement of the past. Oh, crap. Um, no, it's still doable. There we go. All right, done. Uh... Thank you, kind sir. Now to return to the Castle East. I did find the biomechanical sphere. Is that what I use for uh, soul reinvigoration? Not really. But uh, you're the worst, Brad. All right. Accursed pieces. <laughs> nice. Is that a little jar? No. Little jar, little jar, little jar. I'm having no luck with these little jars. Well, at least there's the goblet. Oh, that was the little jar. I feel like those other ones were too. There's the suitcase. Not seeing a glove. Does anybody see a package? Yes. Fifth helmet again. It was easy to find this time. There's the telephone. Sextant, which is of course for uh, navigation at sea. Teddy bear. Oh, it's in the picture. Clock, right there on the mantelpiece. A liar. That's the, that's the, like, the U-shaped harp thing, right, from, uh, Greek mythology. Okay, that was kind of right, my memory. Oh, I got the hook, yay! Little statue, little statue of what, perchance, might thou tell us to me? Oof, there it is. It was apparently a Buddha. Uh, lug wrench. And, uh, fluff. Wow, I didn't use a hint for the first time in how long? Hey, another flow just in light bulb. All right, so three more pieces and we're good. Oh, I think we're supposed to find this one first. Ew. I mean, they're not hard to find, but ew. That was very weird. Was that the one where he cut you into pieces? Oh. Poor ducks? Oh. A tap to shoot game? Hitting the targets. Try to reach your goal. And two clues and maximum limit of. Oh! Nice. To reinitialize the. It's not a jigsaw. To win 25. Okay. Again, it's not a jigsaw. Oh, sorry. What am I doing? So I just have to click on 20 ducks. That's how the game is played. I'm going to switch to my better hand for this. It's fine going with my left hand for searching items, but for quick response, I probably should use my slightly better hand. Is this even really a puzzle? <laughs> of course not. I feel like this would be more better on an iPad, but I don't know if this was made for iPads. I mean, it does seem pretty old. 100! Yay! Wow. That really was a horrible thing for her to say. So wait, why did we do all of that? Just to do it? So many of this game's activities have nothing to do with what we're doing. 
Yay, I finally get to pick up all those rings I was seeing the last time I was here. You know, you'd think there would be more on the chandelier, but uh, you would be wrong. And there's the Bride of Frankenstein's corpse. Sorry, Frankenstein's Bride, but you don't get to be, uh, recombobulated. Seriously, one left. <laughs> My god, is that it now? There were 17 to start with, and they were all perfectly obvious except for one. Gosh darn it. Come on, this can't be this bad. What about over here? Oh, is that it? No, that's not it. How weird was it at the end of uh, Civil War? Civil War game where the game ends with you saving Lincoln from assassination and fixing America. It's a very weird, weird game. Uh, let's see, what have we got? I got nothing. All right, so here's what we're going to do. Uh, we are going to take the hint button because I got nothing. And honestly, wait, is that... No, that's not one. All right, let's just do it then. And he kept clicking because he can't accept failure. I still don't see it, but I'm going to assume that right at the middle of the... Yep, circle, there was one. It's weird for me to not see it even after I've... Uh... <laughs> so creepy. Uh, all right, let's use the bucket to empty the bath. Yes, the battery. And some more ducks. Why did I do the ducks at all? You know what? Not worth going into. Uh, so I don't have to go back to the library, right? And his room doesn't have anything new, so that's all of upstairs. Let's just check here one more time. No, okay. So yeah, uh, let's go downstairs and do a lap around the house to see if there's anything left to pick up. In there, no, in there. Oh, that was the same way. Uh, let's check out the oratory again. Yep, here we go. Carrot, Chinese noodles, eggplant. Always easy to find. Pumpkin banana. So there's the pumpkin, where's the banana? I want to try and make all four disappear at once, but I don't think I'm going to be able to do it. Pumpkin, banana, cabbage. Do we see the apple? Is that the apple? Yep. Wow, I'm not clicking fast enough. I don't know what happened to me. I thought I really had that going. Let's try it again. Uh, so, tomato. Do it with my right hand. Uh, watermelon, coconut, pizza box, tomato. Yeah, I just can't click fast enough to make the screen clear. It's possible it was programmed that way. Wow. What is it? Okay. Uh, diving helmet? <laughs> oh. Brad, you're the worst. Alright, one, two, uh, three. What the hell? I just had to move the jellyfish? Ah, oh, there it is. Yay! Oh, good. We have to do it again with a bunch of different things. This feels like a valuable loose use of our time. You know, you could have just put them all on screen at once. The things I need. Or at least more than one of them. Alright. Two and... We got one! Thank you. That one I was ready for. What are those? They're not hearts. I have no idea what that symbol's supposed to be. A grape? Ah, well, not a grape. But a fruit of some kind? Anyway, whatever it was. Oh, oh, that I saw. Yes! Is that all the pieces? Nope, still one more. Oh! And I suspect it will be in the graveyard. <laughs> I've been working on my evil laugh. Thoughts? Yeah. I like it, too. Oh, God. Narcissism, thy name is me. Uh, all right, graveyard. Yes, it was the graveyard. Box, tub, shield, spider. Now, what did they think the word tub means? They think it means barrel, right? No, cr they meant it um, drum is what they thought tub meant. Flower pot, statue, candle. Yep, they think a tub is a drum. I can't I can't explain it. I don't understand it. And I have never felt like this before. Uh, okay. If I were a pumpkin, you'd think I wouldn't be that hard to find. That was awesome. Uh, inside a uh, graveyard. 
but I'm having a weirdly difficult time with this pumpkin. It's not a jack-o'-lantern. Sorry, jackal-lantern. I always say that wrong. Oh, wouldn't it be great if it was a jackal-lantern? Alright. Seriously, you know pumpkins are orange, right, game? And I know you think you're being cute by making the whole background orange in the evening light, but I don't think that was super fair. Is that an egg? No, that couldn't be less of an egg. Wherever this egg is, I got I got nothing. So we're just going to take a hint. I'm checking the trees to see if there's a nest, but nope. All right, so take a hint. Not gonna... Wow, that was really well hidden because it did look a lot like part of the clouds. Wow. These are so terrible to each other. Glue! Oh, nice. Um, okay. Keep doing that wrong. Alright, so that's his one ear. Here's his other ear. I'm assuming... This. Yep, okay, we got this. Oh, it's, it's Frankenstein's monster. I did not get that right away. Alright, let's do this. We all saw that as it was happening, and we were all very embarrassed with it. If by we all means me. Oof. Yay, Frankenstein's monster! It's one of my favorite kinds of monsters. Uh-oh. Hold on a minute. Whose brain is this? I'm, I'm a little concerned now. I guess I should have been suspicious earlier. But this would be quite a twist ending for the game if I was putting Frankenstein's brain back in Janet's body and she's been murdered. Scissors. Hand drill. This makes me want to rewatch The uh, Man with the Two Brains, which I don't care what o Roger Ebert says, I think is enjoyable. That's not cotton wool? No, it's a bandage. Cotton wool must be something else that I'm less familiar with. Um, let's do hand drill and hand saw. Wow. I'm doing a lot of uh, this nonsense, aren't we? Is that a wooden pencil? Yes, it is. Are there other types of pencil? He said, like, somehow immediately forgetting the existence of mechanical pencils. Oh, I did need the bandage after all. Yay! Uh, okay... Handsaw flask. Handsaw flask. Ah, good. I would have called that a vial, but again, this game does not ask my opinion much. Handsaw? Oh, it's a solid movie. Well, not solid per se, but entertaining. Uh, hold on. There you are. Face off. Okay, it's not. It's not good. But it's definitely entertaining. Read an early script for that once when it was set in the the future, so the technology made more logical sense. It still didn't really make sense. Is that cotton wool? It is. Yay! We're down to handsaw. And that's you right there. Yes! I would love to fix the machine by using my fur 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 fur. Okay. Oh, you're kidding me. Alright. Yeah, I know we're asked we're always asked to make, you know, uh, how shall I put this? Concessions to, you know, the believability of any of the technologies in these video games and the way they try to interpret it. But the idea that Match 3 is ever, under any circumstances, representing any real-life action other than matching three items is crazy to me. Okay.
Wow. Little, uh, little Yoda in there. Wait, what? Who? I'm not, I don't think of myself as an easily disgusted person, but this is, this is borderline. In questionable taste. Yes. Got a corner. I do enjoy managing to put those together. Uh, you and you. You and you. You and... Oh, and we're done. All right, yay! Knit one, purl one. I don't know anything about stitching. Come in useful again. Yay! Yes, let's. Waka Waka? So that's, that's the end. So no closure on that weird hint that we were using Dr. Frankenstein's brain there, right at the end. I like that the parallax scrolling is kind of broken, so now we're just seeing that there's no drawing down there. And in fact, there's no way to sta station the parallax, so the black nothingness doesn't appear. Not your best work, fellas. Alright, so that was Frankenstein the Dismembered Bride. Let's see what the extras are. Are we going to replay the puzzles? Okay, well that's not a lot of... Is that what makes it the extended edition? I wonder. But anyway, uh, <laughs> this was not a stellar game. It was uh, lovably daft at some point. It's nice to see a uh, old school hog that actually lets you gradually clean up screens so subsequent trips to them are easier because they're a lot less cluttered. That is nice. Uh, it's still not a great game, though. I'm not gonna not gonna be recommending this to anyone, but uh, I, I won't lie and say I didn't have a good time because I did clearly enjoy myself. So I've been the Hinamjet Guru. Thanks for coming along this journey with me. Uh, if you've had a great time, please, well, even good time, really, like and subscribe. And uh, if you have any hidden object game related questions or comments, you can send them on over to GC underscore Danny at Twitter. And uh, yeah, I think that's that. I guess I will see you elsewhere on the channel. Um, maybe I'll do more of these uh, games from this 12-in-1 hidden object game collection. All right, see you there.